Questions for Peyton? We'll start first with Mark D'Amico. Hey, Peyton. How different do things feel right now after these two consecutive wins um, as opposed to maybe where they felt Thursday morning, Thursday afternoon after you guys had lost a couple games, you didn't know what was going to happen at the trade deadline. I'm just curious your perspective on how, how different the vibe is around the team and what you guys are feeling right now. Um, you know, I think we got a little momentum going. So for us, it's kind of a, kind of a fresh start. Um, we have, I think, I don't know how many games we have left, but like we have a big home stretch coming up. So for us, it's just, each and every game building on that momentum and keep on winning and, and making something happen. Um, but I, I think, you know, after the trade deadline, it was kind of a, a restart, a refresh for everybody. And now to lock in and, and finish the season out strong, regular season. Keith Smith. Hey, Peyton, um, with Jeff Teague traded and, and knowing that there's going to be these nights when Kemba doesn't play, does that change your mindset at all, knowing those minutes are really going to come your way? Uh, yeah, I mean, definitely. I, I can go out there and I can be really aggressive and know that I have to try to make plays. Um, you know, certain times on the court with certain guys, you know, my role changes and I'm a floor spacer and getting guys the balls. I'm trying to find ways to be aggressive, but uh, nights like this, I try to go in and be extra aggressive and making things happen. Gary Washburn. Well, Peyton, kind of touching on what Keith said, what's it like to kind of have more responsibility on the floor and kind of be more of a floor general with the increased minutes? And then secondly, uh, are you rooting for, I mean, Oregon State in the Elite Eight, does that make you cringe? Um, and are you rooting for it because they're a Pac-12 school, but they're also your arch rival? Uh, so I'll answer the first question first. Um, you know, that's that's what I work work for, uh, you know, to keep growing as a player. Uh, always trying to be a floor general, but always trying to add to my game. So, you know, for this year and next year and years to come, and that, you know, I'll become a player that I want want to keep, become and uh, that's somebody that's a could be a really effective for this team and helping this team win so um as far as Oregon State goes I'm actually uh half really happy for them um coach Tinkle is a great coach um and you know for me it's like uh you know back like back to pack they say that for Pac-12 but um I love seeing Pac-12 schools succeed and, and that conference succeed I think we still have uh four teams alive so that's awesome We'll wrap it up right there. Thank you, Peyton. Thank you.